about five years ago, the government asked Nesta and our vice chairman and the head of Double Negative, uh, Alex Hope, to look at the skills gap in this country. I was very aware of there was simply not enough computer programmers, not just for our industry, but for all creative and digital industries. You know, our industries are growing at a rapid rate and those jobs are in high demand. We managed to convince the government that the ICT curriculum was irrelevant for the digital age and they acted on our advice and the new computing curriculum came into effect last September. But we also decided that we need something practical to help teachers and resources, particularly from the games industry, um, in classrooms that kids can actually enjoy. So we, we coordinated a bid and won some uh, funding from the Mayor of London and Digital Schoolhouse was born. Digital Schoolhouse is a unique way for children to learn about computing through engaging workshops. During the course of a day, the pupils can learn about a particular topic or a concept with a unique blend of resources. We are doing Makey Makey and this time we'll try the piano with our different arrows. It's designed to really upskill, inspire and engage pupils and teachers with the new computing curriculum. It's really fun because it's not really like any other kind of lesson. When we are young children, we learn through play and exploration. We continue to do that as we get older. When they get something right, they just feel so enthusiastic. There's just this the spark in their, in their eyes, just light up, they go, I get this. It's creative. It's not just lines of text. It is, it is colours, it is uh, creation, it is innovation. It's just useful in loads of different situations. Each secondary school has nominated a lead digital schoolhouse teacher. They then deliver workshops to visiting primary school pupils. The teachers are assured that they know that during this day their pupils have actually covered a part of the national curriculum. We don't all have the same in schools and this is a great chance to experience some of that. And for yeah. ourselves we can there's things here that we, we're able to take back to school and disseminate back to staff. If I look at our options process and the number of children who are now interested in taking computer science at GCSE, there's been a significant increase and there's no question that that's because of a, a greater understanding of the power of ICT and the enthusiasm is, is something that's tangibly different since our involvement. It's a win-win for everybody involved in the project. If we can harness the power of play-based learning in the classroom, then we can really unlock the potential behind each child.